In order to uh, start working with the database, we first need to call the open database function and pass over the short name of the database, its version number, the long name, which is kind of a detailed description, and the maximum size in bytes. We want the web browser to allocate for the new database or the database that already exists. If it works uh, successfully, then we have an object we can use to work with uh, this uh, database. Here in this code sample, when we execute it, we get a message including the version number. Now, if we give it a try, as you can see, it works fine. Uh, but if, for example, I try to change the version number, while keeping the same name unchanged, then we shall get a problem mismatch in the version number. We can handle that mismatch and just upgrade uh, the, 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 the database and change it to, to become version 2. On the other hand, if I change the name of the database then of course there won't be any problem because this is already this is a new database and no matter which version number I place the database doesn't exist so there shouldn't be any problem with the version number